Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 5th. Now, keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you, okay? So that means not every reading is for you. What do we have for a message? What is coming in? What is coming in? Emperor, that just flipped out. So the emperor could be an Aries, it doesn't have to be. This is somebody that is in charge, taking the lead. This is a leader. So we have a leader here that is taking charge. This is somebody that is very structured, very organized, um, in a very powerful position, taking a position, making a decision. A, a decision is being made. The, the decision that is being made is best for everybody involved. This is this whoever this person is. They are they are taking the lead. Okay, this person is taking charge. They are um, you know this guy is this person is battle ready. This is a masculine energy. This person is ready. They are ready to fight for something making a very big decision this is a decision maker person that is in a position of authority very decisive ten of cups making a decision about happiness about a relationship about fulfillment there is, there is fulfillment here. I mean, this is happiness. It's happily ever after. It's about a family. It's about a relationship. Somebody is making a decision about a relationship right now. Focusing on a relationship. Focusing on happiness. We got somebody here though that is not happy. They're in a situation that isn't growing. You know, there's no growth. There's there's uh, darkness. Okay, there, there's there's a lack of clarity. There's unhappiness. There's no growth. So it feels like this emperor, whoever this emperor is, this is a, a leader that is taking charge of a situation is unhappy about their current circumstances. There's 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 a. A lack of happiness there. There's no growth. And they're thinking about happiness, making a very big decision right now. Definitely thinking about love, okay? But it, this is like discontent. There's an opportunity for love that is being missed, okay? It's being ignored. We have an individual here that is sad. They are, it feels like they're being ignored. Definitely unhappy. We have unhappy, I think we have two people that are not happy, honestly. It feels like both of these people are thinking about the relationship. They're thinking about, you know, their future happiness. But right now, there's some lack of clarity, right? And the sun reverses no clarity. It's, it's uh, no growth. False impressions darkness somebody is in a situation that they need to uh, there's an opportunity for happiness here there is but it's being ignored somebody's being ignored <laughs> it 
Eight of Swords reversed. Now the Eight of Swords reversed is an obstacle that is being removed. Somebody has been in a place of fear. They've been letting their thoughts get the best of them. They've been staying in an uncomfortable situation where there's no growth. I was clarifying the sun reversed, but that obstacle of fear and uh, is being removed because the emperor is a person that doesn't let fear hold them back. Okay, this is somebody that is definitely taking the the leadership position. This is somebody that's taking their position. They're ready. They're ready. They're ready to take charge. They're battle ready. This is somebody that is ready to fight for for a relationship of some sort, for happiness. For I mean, that Ten of Cups is happiness. It's happily ever after. There's an obstacle that has been be that is being removed. I feel like we have somebody here that has been lying to themselves as well. They've been lying to themselves. They were staying in a situation because, I don't know why, because it was felt comfortable, but it wasn't. But they reevaluated. They've been reevaluating for some time. Oh, look where it just fell out, just like that in my hand, four of wands. Four of wands is happiness. It is commitment. It is getting together. There's going to be an upcoming get together. This is somebody who wants commitment, that wants happiness. Uh, right under the Ten of Cups too. So there is somebody that is going to, to make a decision in regards to her relationship. They're going towards happiness. They've been ignoring an opportunity and they haven't been very happy, but there's happiness. This person is looking at extreme happiness. It's like there's an opportunity for happiness here. There is. I think there's going to be an upcoming get together, a party maybe, I don't know, somebody. This is coming out of darkness. It is. Somebody is coming out of a dark situation where they have been controlled, they have been confined, and they have been restricted. But they choose to let fear keep them there. Temperance reversed. Temperance reversed is repeating negative patterns. Unbalanced, unwilling to compromise. This person has been in a relationship with a person that is unwilling to compromise. extremely frustrated with the whole deal it's like they've been missing an opportunity for love waiting for somebody to commit that will not commit and there's another opportunity that is right here temperance reverse that is not going well somebody is in a relationship that has not been going well There's some poor health here as well. Somebody's health may be declining with the temperance reversed and the sun card reversed. That's not good health. I feel like we have somebody here that has been choosing to neglect their own self-care. They've been choosing to neglect themselves because they've been in a relationship that wasn't feeding them. You know, it wasn't feeding their them light was feeding them darkness. But anyhow, I do see somebody that is going right towards happiness. I got the three of cups on the bottom. That's happiness as well. 
Okay, that's a reunion or joy or getting together, a party. We do have a get together a couple times here, so I'm wondering if somebody is going to be getting together with somebody. I feel like there's been a lot of depression here. We have somebody, this emperor has been depressed, they've been restricted, they've been confined, they've been stuck, they've been uh, struggling with uh, going in a new direction because where they are at, it was safe. But I do see, this is like seeing the light, seriously. This is, this is like, there's happiness right here. It's, it's clear, it really is. <sighs> this, this, this emperor is a boss, okay? They're a boss or a business owner. This is somebody that is very set, you know, very capable, very wise, has a lot of life experience, but has been depressed because they have chosen to stay in a situation because, I don't know why, why, why did they stay in this situation? Because, why, that's fun, why, why did they stay in this situation? Ace of Cups reversed, oh my goodness. Money, Knight of Pentacles in reverse on the bottom because of money, because it was it was safe. Sup Knight of Pentacles is super safe because it was safe. But there weren't no there ain't no love there because they couldn't master their emotions. Because it was safe. They stayed in the situation because it was safe. And it may have been, you know, there was some sort of financial gain to staying there. But I feel like there's a decision that is going to be made that really this person is deciding to go after happiness after they have been extremely frustrated and depressed in the whole nine yards. We definitely have happiness in the future, a get together, a reunion of some sort. Um, Ah, the world, the world upright. That is a major completion of a cycle. It is an accomplishment. This is somebody that is stepping into a new era, stepping into a new life. They are uh, ending that old phase. They're making, they're definitely making a decision. It's the end, okay? It's the end of something very prominent that has taught them a lesson in their lives. Okay, they've, they've, it's over. The, the world card is a completion. It is a major completion. Somebody has learned a lesson that has caused their evolution. You know, uh, there could also, there could also be a change of residence here. Somebody maybe, we have home a couple times. And we have, we have, we have, we have the 10, the 10 of cups, and then we have the world card. Those are both completions. Somebody has been in a situation where they didn't receive the, the love that they needed. The sun reversed and the ace of cups reversed, but it was comfortable. And now that cycle is ending. This is the end of a cycle, a phase of where there was discontent. You know, that cycle is ending because we have somebody here that is stepping into a new world, stepping into a new existence this is leaving it all behind it's the end it is the end of that cycle it is seeing the light as well i said it before and I, i'm gonna say it again because this is like a light bulb moment i do believe that somebody is going down another path right towards happiness and a lot of it this is the beginning of a new journey They're gonna be working with somebody else, the Three of Pentacles now, where there is mutual respect, where they can use their skills. This is the end of being unhappy. It is the end of darkness, right? That's what it is, because that world card is right underneath the sun reversed. This is the end of a dark situation because this, this emperor is making a decision. This is a decision maker. He's, he's taken the lead. He's about to do something. The emperor is about to do something. This is a planner. Very wise.
wise individual. He's and he sees an opportunity for love because he sees it's right there. Okay, I gotta show you. He does. He it's like this. You see, he sees. He sees that Ace of Cups. That's an Ace of Cups. And there's a woman down here who is sad. She's she's being ignored. By the looks of things. Anyhow. But underneath this Four of Cups is the Four of Wands. So, you know, that is a commitment. That's a happy commitment. That's happily ever after. It's marriage or something like that. Anyhow, I do believe that, uh, and above that four of wands is a ten of cups. So anyhow, I do believe that uh, there is a new commitment here. There's a new commitment. We have an emperor that is taking charge, that is looking at an opportunity for love that does lead to commitment. I don't even know, maybe even marriage. I mean, that's the marriage card. Um, leads to happily ever after. There could be a reunion here, though, as well. There could, you know, that, that could, it's a reunion. The, the Four of Wands and we had the Three of Cups could be a reunion between two people that, I mean, the Four of Wands is, is sometimes considered a soulmate card. So there could be a reunion between soulmates. It feels like this woman has been waiting. She'd been waiting for her, I don't know, I was going to say a husband. <laughs> we have the end of a loveless situation this is the end the world card is underneath the sun the sun is a card of love it's one of these cups it is the end of a dark situation this person is taking charge they are making a move there is a move here too. The world could be a change of residence. Is the end, you know. Major completion of a cycle. The end. The end of a journey. It's a whole new life from here. It takes a lot of strength and courage and confidence and willpower and determination to replace your fear with faith. So I do believe that we have a person that is replacing their fear with faith and they are stepping into a new life. This is just like stepping over the edge, okay? This really is major completion of a cycle. This is somebody who is very courageous, has a lot of courage, and it looks like they uh, are very strong, strong, letting go of fear, no fear. They've been in a place of fear. This is letting go of the fear and doing it. I'm doing it. I'm, I'm leaving. I'm stepping. That cycle is over. This is finding the courage and the confidence and the strength and the determination and the willpower to just leave it all behind that the world card is the, i'm leaving it behind i mean I, seriously this is a major accomplishment the end of a story endings always lead to new beginnings right and I do see happiness in the future. This emperor is looking right at a huge opportunity for love. It's beautiful. There's there's soulmates here. There is. There is. You think about doves. Doves are love. That there is. Okay. These are like, they stay together. They stay together. And forever. So anyhow, I do believe that we have a masculine energy that is taking charge and they are making a very big decision that is best for everybody involved. And it does, this decision, whatever it is, is, is a big ending. Okay, because that was this is like a stepping into a new life. It's like 
this is what we got to do. We got to end this. We got to end this now. This is, it's over. I mean, that's what the world card is. It's an ending. It's a major ending. It's the last card in the deck. It's that this journey is done. It's over. It's a very courageous decision to just leave it all behind and go. And that is what I got. Good luck.